YouTube kick. Welcome. A man tells us that he can best feed. Please, if you're eating, please put up your snacks. Let's get to it. Hi, I'm Abby and I'm transgender. So, update. I got my uh, two new pumps that you can see. And, uh, yes, I just started. And, yes, transgenders do lag tape. So, get it through your head. See? See? Oh! We can lag tape. Oh! Really resonant. Yeah, it's leaking out, see? All right, baby, we got... Oh! Come, Come on, baby. Um, so that's just to keep you guys on the update. I got the two pumps. I'm really happy. Um, they're working great. Oh, wow, they got different modes. I had a little TP. But, new and approved, Abby. Pumping. You get, look like you got a fetish, a dog. Level. So that was my update. So now I should be able to pump a whole lot more. Because, God dang, you got to pump a lot. So, got to get back to pumping. Stay tuned. I'm going to keep you guys up to date on me. Wow. Love you guys. That was absolutely disturbing um, to even watch. Um, but I bet you're wondering to yourself, well, how are they like dating? Excellent question, my friend. Now, I know you guys like videos. I understand that. But sometimes we got to sit back. We have to do a little bit of reading, a little bit of digging. DJ, can you get it over for me? Bloop, bloop. Okay, thank you, sir. All right, so <clears throat> I was reading this uh, whole article earlier talking about breastfeeding, and we'll start right here. <clears throat> Healthcare providers working with families should be familiar with medical, emotional, and social aspects of gender transition to provide optimal family-centered care and to meet nutritional needs of the infant. The CDC also states that transgender parents may need help with maximizing milk production, supplementing with pasteurized donor human milk or formula, medication to induce lact uh, lactation or avoiding medication that inhibit lactation, suppressing lactation for those choosing not to breastfeed or chest feed, in finding appropriate location management support or peer support and emotional support, the Daily Mail reported that the recommendations apply to biological men after taking hormone drugs can, after horm taking hormone drugs can produce uh, drugs can produce their own breast milk. And the FDA has warned. <clears throat> pay attention, people. The FDA has warned that one of the drugs, which is, I'm assuming it goes, domperidone. Domperidone. Could be wrong on that. I apologize. And they can pass into the breast milk in small amounts and, and sometimes give babies irregular heartbeats as a result. Now, this person also went on to say, before we continue on with that, This is why I say it's so dangerous to give in to the delusion. You people, when you think you give in to, oh, I'm going to call him he, she, and live all my life. Mm -mm. Because what you really do, and I'm being honest here, and I'm being as nice. I'm not trying to be insulting. I'm not trying to be offensive towards these people. But I tell these all the time, when you give in to the pronoun game, you are feeding into the delusion. And what happens when you feed into the delusion? You start, these people really start thinking and believing that they are the opposite gender, whichever way. And when they start to believe that, they start to believe they can do things that way. And when they truly can't do things that way, they end up taking drugs. And these drugs that can be harmful to other people, they don't care. Because me and you have been saying he and she and been calling them what they want to be called. Instead of helping them and be like, hey, you got to maybe work your way out of this delusion. We encourage it and say it's okay. And then when they finally give in to the delusion and then they start getting breasts and then they start taking this drug that when you give it to infants can call ir irregular heartbeats. And if you don't know, irregular heartbeats in a child, especially an infant, if you've ever had an irregular heartbeat, you know what it can lead to. You know, you get enough irregular heartbeat, at least to AFib, which can be very dangerous, right? You continue, you do this with an infant? The Daily Mail also reported that experts that have conscious trans women from using what's known as the Newman Gardfar protocol, which includes consuming a cocktail of drugs to allow one to lactate.
The long-term implications of a treatment is not known, neither for adults nor babies. New York-based uh, Dr. Stuart Fisher told the Daily Mail that it's very hard to believe that the breast milk which naturally occurs in biological female is the same as the breast milk created by a hormone medica medication in biological man, noting that if it's been... If it's been tested a handful of times, how would we know the long range uh, effect? That's the thing is we have no idea. Zero idea. I want to read this one part too. A 2004 advisory stated in re response to a reports that women may be using an unapproved drug. Uh, the same uh, Domperdon. Domperdon? To increase production, lactation, the Food and Drug uh, Administration is warning breastfeeding women to not use this project uh, product because of safety concerns. It's even bad for women to use it. Normal, everyday women to use this to get lactation because it can be dangerous. But once again, why is this happening? We can easily say, oh, it's because they're freaks and creeps. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, but also think about it. If you are giving into the delusion, if you are saying, okay, I'll call you a woman. Okay, I'll call you a woman. You want to be called a woman? Cool. Even though you're not. Oh, you want to go into the bathroom? It's cool. You know what? It is what it is. You live your life. Uh, oh, you want to chop off your, you want to give yourself breast? Cool. Oh, you want to chop off your breast? Cool. Oh, you want to give yourself, um, you want to give yourself private parts? Okay, cool. Oh, you want to chop them off? Cool. You're not harming nobody wrong because when you give it to this stuff you think it just stops with them because these people have children these people have children and you can see this breastfeeding drug will end up hurting these infant people and we don't even know the long-term effects why these little babies and infants are getting used as hamsters gerbils they're just it's being experimented on because we have no idea how are you supposed to test that it would be immoral to test this medication that gives you lactation on infants. Like, how are you supposed to do that? Because what if an infant dies in the process? It's an immoral, unethical thing to even test. That's why we don't do a lot of tests on humans. That's why we used to do it. Well, I think we still do. But that's why we normally test stuff on animals. So how, so what, these little infants are going to be part of a experiment? It's telling you not to use it. You got weirdos like this guy doing it. And I want to say this. When I say weirdos, I'm just trying to keep myself from saying other words. When I say weirdo, I'm pretty much saying that these people who don't care, these people who are selfish, and these people who have fallen into delusion, and yes, they are main, mainly they are to blame. That narcissism is their problem. But we also cannot help them. We have to be brutally honest with these people. And I don't care if we get hated. Because the only other results is to be what loved to be loved about 0.7% of the population that will grow. Eventually it will grow more, but what's the alternative to be liked by some people to be like, Oh, yay. I, I'm a trans ally now. Yay. While other people get hurt in the process. While little infants get hurt in the process. While people fall into a deep depression as the process, they end up transitioning and falling into an even deeper depression as the process. They end up taking their life as the process. All because I wanted to be like, yay, I'm a trans ally. Yay. That sounds crazy. I'm never going to be a guy who's like, yeah, I, I'm glad I'm a trans ally. Go ahead and chop off your testicle, testicles and chop off your penis. Just go ahead and do it, man. And even though I know in my head that this is going to lead this person more than likely to either take their life or become even more depressed. Statistically, we can say that. Am I supposed to be happy about that? Because I was, I didn't want to upset that person. Forget that. Screw that. I'm protecting the kids. I'm, and I'm also protecting these people from themselves because they matter. We scream out trans rights are human rights. Why don't we scream out that trans people are people? And I'm not going to treat you like some Frankenstein experiment to go do stuff for yourself. I can't stop you, but don't, don't expect nothing from me. I'm going to show you love. I'm going to show you what true love is. True love is telling you the truth and telling you you've got something going on mentally. If you really feel this is going to change you, that's true love because the true love is not telling you, Oh, go do whatever you want. Oh, up, Oh, he took his life. Oh, she took her life. I guess she wasn't happy. 
Selfish, dog. Let me know what y'all think in the comment section down below. I'm out of here. Peace.